This happens to your body when you sleep after eating. Hello to all the tired souls out there. With quarantine keeping us indoors this year, our energy levels seem to have taken a hit, wouldn't you agree? On the brighter side, it has also provided ample opportunities to indulge in our favorite foods. How often have you enjoyed a hearty meal only to find yourself dozing off shortly after? Or perhaps you've made a habit of indulging in fatty snacks before bedtime? While it might feel comforting at the moment, there are several important factors to consider. Let's delve into seven intriguing aspects of what occurs in your body when you eat before sleep. Can you effectively burn calories during sleep? What about the dreaded heartburn? And could late night eating actually influence your dreams? Brace yourselves for some eye-opening revelations. 1. Yes, you might get nightmares. Consuming a substantial meal right before bedtime triggers heightened brain activity, thanks to the activation of your metabolism. This initiates the calorie burning process, causing your brain to become more active and potentially leading to vivid dreams. Certain foods are more prone to inducing nightmares than others, take carbohydrate heavy foods, for instance. Indulging in a bowl of pasta or a large sandwich before sleep could pave the way for unsettling dreams. Research has linked starchy foods to poor sleep quality and disturbing dreams, with studies showing that both pasta and bread can worsen sleep. Similarly, indulging in sugary desserts like cookies and cake before bedtime has been associated with unsettling dreams, as reported by a significant group of individuals in a 2015 study. Additionally, spicy foods can influence dream content, consuming hot wings, for example, may lead to recurring nightmares. The heat from spicy foods raises body temperature, disrupting brain activity and potentially exacerbating nightmares. If you've noticed a trend of darker dreams after eating before naps, it might be beneficial to scale back on late-night snacks. 2. Your quality of sleep gets disturbed. Even if nightmares aren't plaguing your nights, eating right before bedtime can significantly impact the quality of your sleep. This is because your body continues to undergo the metabolism process as you lie down, making it difficult to fall asleep and resulting in a lighter sleep cycle. For those accustomed to bedtime snacking, the sensation of food churning in the stomach is all too familiar, with the audible workings of the digestive system sometimes disrupting sleep. Moreover, indulging in chocolate or soda before bed introduces caffeine into your system, which hampers the ability to achieve restful sleep. Caffeine, known for promoting alertness, reaches peak levels in the bloodstream within 30 to 60 minutes of consumption and remains in the body for 3 to 5 hours. So, if you're burning the midnight oil with a late-night coffee to stay awake, the lingering effects of caffeine might hinder your ability to fall asleep when you finally retire for the night. This can leave you feeling fatigued and unrefreshed the next morning. However, there's conflicting information regarding bedtime snacking's impact on sleep. While some suggest that a small snack before bed can help stave off hunger and promote satisfaction, further research is needed to clarify its effects definitively. 3. You'll get heartburn. I understand that you're feeling both hungry and tired, but it's important to consider the impact on your digestive system when you lie down immediately after eating. Doing so can lead to unpleasant symptoms like heartburn. When you're upright, gravity helps keep stomach acid moving downward to aid digestion. However, lying on your side can allow acid to come into contact with sensitive parts of your digestive system, increasing the likelihood of heartburn. This effect is even more pronounced if you already experience acid reflux, a common condition known as gastroesophageal reflux disease GERD. GERD occurs when stomach acid travels up into the esophagus, causing discomfort such as heartburn, throat irritation, and even asthma symptoms. To minimize these issues, it's advisable to wait at least 3 hours after eating before lying down, even if you don't have reflux. This practice can help prevent digestive discomfort and promote better overall health. If you're planning to take an afternoon nap, it's wise to schedule your lunch accordingly to avoid potential discomfort. 4. More bathroom trips. Are you familiar with nocturia? It refers to the heightened need to urinate during the night, causing individuals to wake up specifically to use the restroom. 
Nocturia is a prevalent condition, impacting over 50 million people in the United States alone. Several factors can contribute to this condition, including excessive fluid intake, sleep disorders, or bladder dysfunction. Additionally, nocturia can be exacerbated by high caffeine consumption, as caffeine often acts as a diuretic, increasing urinary frequency. If you're experiencing nocturia, it's advisable to limit fluid intake before bedtime to help manage this condition effectively. 5. You gain weight. Indeed, if you indulge in a substantial meal and remain sedentary afterward, weight gain can swiftly become a concern. When you recline immediately after eating, your body has limited opportunity to burn off those consumed calories. While feeling fatigued post-sugar rush is common, it's crucial to resist the temptation to nap if you wish to avoid packing on extra pounds. Consistently engaging in this habit can lead to noticeable weight gain over time. However, conflicting viewpoints exist regarding the relationship between bedtime eating habits and weight management. Some suggest that consuming a small snack before bed could aid in weight loss by curbing nighttime cravings, thereby preventing additional calorie intake. 6. Stabilizes blood sugar. Understanding your blood sugar levels can be complex. It's a dynamic aspect of your health that can fluctuate significantly overnight. In the morning, your liver ramps up glucose production, which translates into increased blood sugar levels, providing you with energy for the day ahead. However, for individuals with diabetes, waking up with excessively high blood sugar levels is not uncommon. Conversely, some people experience nocturnal hypoglycemia, where blood sugar levels drop during the night, disrupting sleep and leaving them feeling sluggish upon waking. Whether your blood sugar spikes or dips, having a quick snack before bed may help stabilize your levels, ensuring you have adequate energy throughout the night. This can lead to a more refreshed and energetic start to your day. While this approach holds promise, further research is needed to fully understand its implications. 7. You'll get good vitamins. Despite discussing some potential drawbacks, certain foods offer valuable nutrients. If you're considering a bedtime snack, opt for lighter options with minimal sugar and low calorie content. For instance, consider enjoying a banana, which is rich in magnesium, known to relax muscles and promote sleep. Another excellent choice is almonds, which not only provide magnesium but also contain tryptophan, a compound that regulates nerve function and heart rhythm. Additionally, turkey, a protein-rich food, can help curb nighttime hunger and induce a feeling of fullness. If meat isn't your preference, oats are a satisfying alternative that provide essential vitamins and minerals, as well as promote healthy insulin production and stabilize blood sugar levels. For those seeking a flavorful yet healthy late-night snack, a teaspoon of honey can be beneficial. Consuming honey in moderation stimulates melatonin release in the brain, facilitating easier sleep onset. Whether you frequently nap or indulge in bedtime snacks, Making informed choices about your nighttime eating habits can contribute to better overall health and sleep quality. If you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comment section down below and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end, also make sure to check out our next highlighted video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.